overwhelmed by this whole program. So, good morning to all the leaders here. Who is a leader? A leader is a person who has influence. This morning, I was driven by a car sent by the school. For me, that driver is a leader because he is going to influence what I, I will reach here. The security man at the gate, he is also a leader. He decides whether I come in or not. The lady who received me at the uh, entrance, she is also a leader because she is the one who guided me to the place. So a leader is a person who has an influence on the outcome. It's not just by position alone. That's why I said everybody in this room is a leader. But these young ones have been given a special role to play as part of the school council. Now, being a leader is something very exciting, but it also has a great responsibility which, which is uh, given to us. Now, a leader, especially a student leaders, these are, there are three keys I want to leave with you. The first key is truth. Understand, believe and practice what is truth. And that's one of the major qualities that a leader should have. Understanding, believing and practicing the truth. The second one key which I want to talk about is trust. Develop a culture of trust. You yourself should be trustworthy both at home, at school and in your neighborhood as well as you should learn to trust others. So it's a mutually, you know, it's a mutually beneficial scenario when you start trusting the other person, the other people also start trusting you. And thirdly, I just want to say one more, one more key is being tenacious. Being tenacious is nothing but being determined. See, life is not full of a, a bed of roses. Uh, usually you ask, you ask the statement, how's life? Oh, nothing much to say. But I only say that life will be good, but circumstances may not be good. And that's where you need to have a very tenacious approach. So my dear children, please remember that truth, trust and tenacity, these are the three keys that will take you forward in being a leader who will influence the outcome of any kind of a situation. And that's what leadership is all about. It's not getting, it's not about being elected. Uh, to a political power, a political position, can be the Prime Minister, the President or the Minister, Chief Minister or even of a small association, that's all elected positions. But what is important that you need to carry within yourself is that you are, have an influence on the outcome, that's where uh, you are a leader. And I especially want to thank the, uh, the, uh, the teachers of school because they are the ones who are actually nurturing leaders. Now if you look at all these children here, I was talking to the principal madam and she said, you know, these all as these are not tiny ones are also there as leaders. She said, yes, we just looked at them, we found out that some of them have something, a spark within them which, which can they be called as a leader. And that's why they are up here. So parents, all your children are leaders, you need to nurture them. And with these, with these three needs that they follow the truth, have trust and be tenacious. So thank you very much for uh, having me over here and God bless everyone.